Good morning, everyone. Captain James Polk here, the Marion County Sheriff's Office, with Claws and Paws, not on Monday, but <laughs> on Wednesday edition. So we have Kate here from the Humane Society to tell us a little bit about her new dog. This is Diesel, and he's about a two to three year old blue nosed pit bull. Um, he actually came into the shelter as a stray. Uh, we've had him since May, and we haven't been able to locate his owner. We've had a lot of people say, Oh, that looks like my friend's dog, Diesel. Um, the reason we know his name is because it was written on his collar when he came in. Mm. Um, but he, no leads have led to find an owner. And um, we're pretty sure at this point, you know, if, if someone really wanted their dog, they would have found him by now. So <laughs> he's ready to be up for adoption. He is very, very playful. He loves toys. Um, he would be the perfect partner for running. Um, I run a lot. I just ran a half marathon this weekend. And um, I would love to take a dog like this with me because he would keep me safe and he is very active. Um, he would not be probably appropriate for a home with other animals, but he would make a great um, par uh, partner for someone who just wants an only dog. Well, there you go. Diesel is his name. Mm -hmm. So make sure if you've got an idea of someone who's looking for a dog like this, because I know one thing, he wants a He's forever home. He wants someone to play with and to love and take care of. So make sure you call the Humane Society, ask for Kate, and make sure you adopt Diesel. And now on for the rest of our daily crime report. It seems that someone broke into a home in the 16,000 block of Southeast Highway 42 in Weirsdale. They cut the bedroom window screen and entered through the window. Suspects removed $3,300 worth of jewelry and one bottle of pain pills. Deputy Green responded to the 13,000 block of Southwest 14th Street Road in reference to a disturbance. As Deputy Green was speaking with the complainant, the family dog came from nowhere and bit Deputy Green on the left calf causing minor injury. Animal Control responded and found the dog that was not up to date on his shots. Not good. Deputy Wilkes responded to the Walmart in the Shores in reference to a retail grand theft. Loss Prevention stated that a white male exited the store with over $400 worth of merchandise and left in a silver Toyota Tacoma. Deputy Wilkes conducted a traffic stop on the vehicle in the 6800 block of Mary Camp Road. Upon making contact with the occupants, the deputy was able to locate the merchandise in the bed of the truck and placed Dale Nelson under arrest and transported him to the Gold Star Hotel. Someone stole 345 gallons worth of diesel fuel valued at over $1,200 from the Quick King located at Oak Road in the Shores. Seems they're the winners today. This investigation is ongoing. We'll have more information for you on that story tomorrow. That's all for your hump day. It's just about over. Please like us and share us. Download our app if you haven't, and we will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.